Good afternoon guys this is Pushpak Raj and today's topic is on how to create the test case template on the e-commerce application guys i have already created the test case template on multiple domain like banking domain healthcare domain then um, insurance domain then telecom domain so there are the multiple list of the test case template just uh, you need to subscribe this channel uh, so you have getting the all the list of the uh, list of the videos okay so today's topic is on the amazon e-commerce application i have giving this name randomly okay so the product name is amazon e-commerce application module name is product by module creation by who can create it the pushpak raj is a tester or a test engineer who can create that test cases creation date on which date pushpak raj have created that test cases that is a 6 april 2023 and reviewed by ram is a person or senior person in the team who can review that test cases and the review date on which date the ram is reviewed that test cases on the same date he can review that test cases okay guys okay so now the format of test case template so first one is the test case id then test case description precondition test steps expected result actual result and the final conclusion that is what the test case is pass or fail so first test case is test case is tc rz001 tc stand for test case rz stand for amazon application and 001 stands for this is the this is the first test case that's why i have mentioned here that is the 001 then the test case description first one is every application need, need to be user login so precondition is what user is registered so all you know that before uh, working on any application need to register on that application registration means is a simple steps like you have to enter your name mobile number email id father's name mother's name address so like that this is the registration process was you can register then you can getting the login id or password with the help of that login id and password you can easily log into the any application so that is the precondition that is the user is registered test steps are navigate to the e-commerce website first one with the help of any browsers chrome browser mozilla firefox any one browsers okay so in in that you can navigate to the e-commerce website then click on the login button and third one enter the username and password and click on the login button expected result what user is successfully login and redirect you to the home page actual result is same then test case is passed if the actual result is not matched to the expected result then test case is fail then second test case is tcrz002 the product name so once you can what is the meaning of e-commerce e-commerce is a website where you can buy the product from the particular portal or particular application okay so you have to search the product second case so precondition what user is login okay so user is needed to be login otherwise how how they can search the product on that application okay so that is the precondition user is login test steps are navigate to the e-commerce website first step enter the product name in the search bar and click on the search button this is the simple steps guys you can follow any webs uh, e-commerce website so you can get it very well or easily okay the expected result what the product search result are display okay so whatever the product you can search that is you can display if i am already told if the actual and expected match then test case is passed if not then test case is fail then third test cases is tc rz003 add to cart means whatever the product you can search you can add that product then user is login logged and product is available steps search and select the product whatever the product you needed you can search it product and select that click on add to cart button in every e-commerce website you have seen that you have whatever the product you can search you can add to the cart product like that when you are going to the shop and you have to uh, buy the product and uh, put into the your bag so like that you have to add to cart that product okay and click on the add to cart button and verify the product is added to the cart so same step bro like uh, you can buy the product add to cart the product and search that whatever the product you can add is it show in the ad, uh, is it show in your uh, add to cart or not okay and finally product is successfully added to the card Ex ex uh, expected an actual match then test case is passed 
then we can move in the fourth test case guys fourth test case is tc rz004 then update card update card means whatever the product we can add you can update that user has product in the card then steps navigate to the navigate to the card page update the quantity of product then click on the update card button and finally navigate to the card page update the quantity of the product and click on the uh, click on the card button update card button okay then fifth test case is proceed to checkout next is user has product in the card and his and has provide a shipping details shipping details means what guys the address so you have buy the product on the online website so definitely you need to provide the address so with the help of that address that product will be reach on your home okay so that thing then navigate to the card page click on the process to check out the button enter the shipping and payment details and click on the place order button okay and order is successfully placed and order confirm is displayed and final thing is track the order once the order is once the order is done then you have to track that order means how long the product is reach suppose you have buy the product from mumbai and uh, your location is in the amravati so how much time it will take or up to which location the product you have reach so that is known as a tracking process so a user has place on order navigate to the order tracking enter the order id and click on the track order button so you got that point i think and order status and tracking information is displayed so this is a simple one means you have to enter the enter the enter the product track order order or uh, id of that product order id or you can check out how how long the product have reach so in that way guys i will explain the e-commerce application test case template please like this video subscribe it Thank you guys have a good day